Hi there, welcome to Practice Better. In this video, we will go over how to use automations to reduce your administrative work in onboarding clients. To set up an automation, go to My Practice, Automations. Click on the red Fast Action button. If you're part of a team plan, you will first be prompted to select the practitioner before proceeding to create the automation. The first automation you can create is Add slash Invite New Clients. Let's take a look at an example. This is a great automation to add clients and send them invitations to the client portal automatically. If you're giving access to the client portal, you can also give your clients access to the food journal and lifestyle journal. You can have this automation triggered upon a service or package being booked, clients enrolling in a program or upon completion of a form. Optionally, you can also use this automation to apply a tag to your client. Next on our automation list is Update Client Tags. Here's an example. If you're part of a team, depending on your permission settings, you can create a tag automation on behalf of another teammate. Tags are a great way to organize your client list. Instead of manually applying tags on your clients, this automation can apply and remove tags for you depending on the booking, your clients enrolling in a program, or upon a form completion. For example, you can add a discovery call tag to all clients who book a discovery call with you. This way, when glancing at your client list, you know that they're not yet actively working with you. To take it a step further, you can set up a tag automation that replaces the discovery call tag upon your client booking a paid service. Next, you have the ability to set up automations to confirm your one-on-one -on -one booking or packages. Otherwise, by default, you will need to manually approve each booking and package request. These two automations are similar in their setup. However, the one-on-one -on -one session confirmation has extra granular permission settings, which we can take a look at. When confirming one-on-one -on -one bookings, you have the ability to confirm rescheduled sessions as well as new bookings. You can choose to limit which sessions will be auto-confirmed. For example, if you want to limit your in-person sessions, you can choose not to confirm in-person sessions while confirming video and phone sessions. If you work at a multiple locations, you can confirm sessions for specific locations. Within this automation, you also have the ability to give access to the client portal and to both journals. And lastly, you can also use this automation to apply tags. You can also use this automation to mark sessions as confirmed on behalf of your clients. Your clients will not be asked to confirm their attendance in the session confirmation and reminder notifications sent from Practice Better. Next, you can set up an automation to send forms upon a service or package being confirmed. The setup of these two automations is almost the same. Let's take a look at an example. Select a service or package which will trigger the automation. When setting up the automation for services, you can choose the form to be sent immediately or before or after a session date. If you're sending your clients an intake questionnaire, you may not want to select the option to complete the form multiple times. If you're sending a feedback form, you can create a separate form automation that does send the form repeatedly. Next, select the applicable forms. Optionally, you can include a note to your client which will be sent with the available form email sent to your client. You can create a custom payment plan for a specific client by selecting Schedule Installment Payment. Custom payment plans can also be created via the Billing and Payment section within a client's record or under My Practice Billing and Payments under the Payment Plan tab. 
Lastly, you can create automations for tasks. There are two task automations, create tasks and schedule tasks after a booking is confirmed. We will take a look at both examples. Here's an example of creating a task after a booking has been confirmed. With this automation, you can schedule tasks before or after a client session for yourself or for the client. For example, you can use this automation to remind clients to complete forms prior to the session or to fill out a post-session survey. Or you can use this automation to remind yourself to complete client notes and to send a follow-up message after the session. With the Create Task automation, you can utilize this automation to set up tasks for yourself or for the client upon them booking a session, package, enrolling in a program, or completing a public form. This is a great way to keep yourself and your client organized before your initial meeting. For example, you can set up an automation to give your client tasks to complete prior to their initial consultation with you. This can include setting up their client portal, submitting lab work, and completing forms. You can create up to five tasks to include in the automation. Once you've created all of your tasks, you can click the three dots beside your task to edit, disable, and delete your automations at any time. This concludes this video on our available automations. Please check out our Help Center for more information and resources.